We don't get it right away because we weren't ready for it. You have to be ready for wisdom. If you're not asking questions, you're not ready for the wisdom. If I, so I, I knock on your door and I say, I have, I'm here to tell you what the meaning of life is. If you don't care, if you're watching Family Guy and you don't care what life is all about, so you say, please go away, I'm busy. I'm in the middle of my Family Guy episode. You don't care. If it's been gnawing at you and you're only watching Family Guy to distract you and entertain yourself, but really you would love to know what the meaning of life is, so then you'll invite me in. You turn Family Guy off. You say, great, I've been waiting my whole life for someone to tell me what the meaning of life is. Come on in. You have to have the questions. You have to be prepared for wisdom. You have to be worthy for wisdom. He can't just give it to you. You have to do something. So the sages tell us that when we were in Egypt, that we were on a low level, a low level of spirituality. We didn't get taken out because we were so wonderful. We got taken out because we were losing it. We were losing our sense of spirituality. Rabbi Daniel Frisch wrote a sefer on the counting of the Omer. He's an uh, interesting Kabbalist in Israel. And he quotes one of the famous Kabbalists from the 1700s called the Rashash. That was his nickname. And he said, these days, the counting of the Omer days, are not just the main point. What the Sefer of Enoch says, this is the main point. The days in between getting to the Torah is you're doing something. You're preparing yourself because you weren't worthy when you got out. You have to do something to be worthy of the wisdom. So the Rashash says even more than that. He says, these are the key to the whole year. Not just for Shavuot, but these days affect the rest of the year. Your whole year, from now until next Pesach, is dependent on what you do during these 50 days. If you didn't do much with them last year, so then you shouldn't be shocked that life has not made you more happy and successful this year. You gotta do, if you did something last year, you'd feel something this year. So now you have a chance for the coming year. If you do something these 50 days, you'll have something. 